we can see regarding the refractive errors the refractive errors are mainly divided into hyperopia myopia astigmatism so in normal vision the image formed in the retina but in case of hyperopia the image formed behind the retina so the person is not able to uh, see the uh, nearest objects in case of myopia the problem is uh, the image that is formed in front of the retina so the patient uh, will be able to see the difficulties of the far objects in case of astigmatism the image formed in different parts of the retina so the uh, person is not able to visualize the uh, things properly and it uh, will appear as a blurred image so the uh, myopia is otherwise known as near sightedness and uh, when we are when the myopic patients see the far objects it will uh, appear as a blurred Uh, the same things in hyperopia hyperopia uh, there will be a far sightedness so the uh, far sight vision will be present but in case of uh, near sight uh, that will be uh, blurry and in case of astigmatism uh, the the person can make far away and nearby objects but it will be look blurry and distorted in case of presbyopia uh, presbyopia mainly seen in all dash people that is mainly due to the uh, the lens the distorted lens so uh, here the older adults very uh, difficult to see things that is close so mainly the uh, presbyopia is far uh, far sightedness the person is not able to see the near sight objects we can see which all are the corrective measures for this refractive errors in case of hyperopia it can be corrected by convex lens in case of myopia myopia can be corrected by concave lens in case of presbyopia presbyopia uh, the it, it can be corrected by contact lens or the eye glasses i already uh, told that it is occurs due to aging process astigmatism astigmatism corrected by cylindrical lens